So if you guys can follow Gamecom on Twitter, at Gamecom AU, G-A-M-E-C-O-M-A-U. I'm going to go look at their their Twitter followers right now and see what they're at. Let's set a goal, guys, because they, honestly, uh, Gamecom is awesome. They have 167 followers right now. Let's get them to 200 by the end of this match. Let's do that. This match is starting up right now, so we're going to get started. But make sure, while you're watching the match, follow Gamecom AU. Um, like I said, we do need to come together to support this Gears of War Australian community, and Gamecom is the reason it's all possible. Sponsoring this tournament for $400 and four free headsets, and they put out huge high prize money for ACL. And they're the reason that ACL is able to, to strive. So follow Gamecom AU on Twitter, guys. I would greatly appreciate it. We're going to get started off on this. Um, feeling, let's start off with Qualman. Nice. Nice execution slab. All right, Qualman. Qualman at you. Qualman at you. Uh, slab execution. Game one, losers bracket round five. We've got Unknown Circle. versus BBR. Circle. Circle, baby. Okay. Oh, babe. Qualman okay. at you. So Kwamenashi is going to be playing the laundry side of the map, which uh, I agree with. He's going to be going for an ink grenade that isn't there, so playing a little slow. Um, he is alone. No. He's, he's got alone. a 1v2 right here. Yeah. He's going he to try to put a little flank and uh, cross whoever's picking up boom, but he doesn't look like he has any help from his teammates as uh, Tuna is able to snag up that boom pretty easily. Yeah, Kwame playing a little overly aggressive, but not sure if he's able to pick up an incendiary kill. Kwame gets taken out right there, though, pushing up by himself into two members. They have the boom shot. Not sure why he got himself in that position. I completely agree with that. Kwame making a huge mistake for Team BBR as um, Unknown has a three on three and boom shot control. They should be able to take this round. Yeah. They, uh, I don't know. Kwame tried to push up. I, I think he, I, I don't think he knew that uh, Tuna pushed back. I think he thought he pushed up towards nades. So he was going to come in from behind. But uh, as Tuna picks up another kill there on Jesus with a boom shot, so he's two for two, I think, as Dead Zone takes out Simon right there. It is now a 3v1 situation in favor of Unknown. Yeah, and as much as we do want to see Team BBR do a good job, they just got completely run over this first round. And if we want to see them win this match, they cannot make mistakes such as that. They have a four versus three, and uh, Kwame is just going to push up and get killed. You know, as good of a player as he is, not even he can get away with that. I'm sorry, as Hacks is trying to make something happen. This is the former Halo player, the team captain of Team BBR, and he's pushing leadership in a one versus one with the shotgun. That stopping power, though. Yep, yeah. stopping power is tough. It is. That is an awesome gamer tag, leadership. That dude, I am very jealous. I wish that was mine. I'm not going to lie. I wish my gamer tag was leadership. Leader, yeah, isn't that badass? That very is an awesome original. gamer tag. Very original. I guess people are having problems with the stream right now. They can't see the stream. Nah, it should, it should be there. It's people in Australia, I guess. Everyone on Legacy can't see it, and there's other people messaging Hayabusa saying they can't see it. We'll fix it after this match, though. Um, then again, so let's we'll focus a little bit more on this. Uh, we're going to see Team BBR sending two front digger into digger. They have not got the digger as they get a nice ink grenade stun, but Tudor Jeff also gets stunned with the ink grenade, taken out by Qualman at you. Scissor hands does have the our leadership does have the frag grenades in his hands as Scissor's playing a little bit more aggressive right now. Who are you watching? I'm uh, I'm on Scissor right now. It's a three v four situation in favor of BBR as Scissor makes me he's gonna make a push here on Haxu. They're gonna be a one v one down here near the spawn as Haxu's just trying to back up and get some lancers to pour into him. And he oh. wow, Scissor played that well. Two shot down, beautiful, beautiful yeah. play by Scissor, keeping them alive in this round. That's their only chance, and they have a two versus two situation. Leadership might have their grenades left, as they're going to be getting crossed. They're in a tough position right now. One digger left for Summer Simon. He's going to launch it. Uh, okay, digger plays it. He gets leadership full red. Leadership pops the grenade. It's going to take him out. No, it does not. Whoa. DBR played that extremely well, just slowly trapping them up in nades and crossing them from every direction. And they're able to get that, uh, that pretty, I mean, pretty much easy win that round, as Jesus drops three kills, and uh, he's leading the way. Yeah, Haxu, Jesus continuing his dominance. You know, Hex is not looking too good, but he's, uh, he, I mean, he's playing the grenade spot by himself. Yeah. I play that spot, I, I feel for him. It's tough to get points. You're not in the action, you're not really doing much, so, you know, it's tough. I feel for him. They're actually, uh, Team BBR is sending four members to front digger right now. Interesting strat as we see two members at laundry, four uh, unknown. Scissor hands taking a one versus three and managing to get a kill. I don't know how he pulled that off. Three versus three situation right now. Jesus is going to flank the grenades. Yeah, and he's got to make that move because there's two members of, uh, of Unknown that are at Boomshot. They're going to be picking it up here any second as they take out Summer, and there, he, there it is right there. Tuna Fish Jeff picking up the boom, but Ooh. Jesus trying a little last-ditch effort right there. It's a 1v2 situation, but he is against the boom shot. As Wow, that was almost a beautiful boom shot. Yeah. Dead Zone drops his, uh, his shotgun for the boom shot, which is a pretty smart decision. But not sure Jesus is getting him stuck in a very bad spot right here. 
Where is? Oh, Jesus, just sitting right there. He's being does sneaky. Dad does Dad don't even know where he is? I, I, I don't, don't think he did for a second, but he does know. Yeah. He probably got the call off from his teammates, so yeah, Jesus is going to keep moving. I like the way he's playing this one versus two. He's just going to continue moving around the map, try and make an opportunity for himself, which he might be able to do right here. If he can take out Tuna, he's going to Tuna. Oh! Tuna's last one. No, he's got one more shot. Time, baby. Okay. He made Tuna miss a shot. He's going to be getting flanked right now, though, with a wide Lancer. Spawn is a very bad spot to be right now. And wow. Tuna makes this boom shot. He gets full ready. He gets wow. down. Oh my goodness. He Not true. He just downs Tuna. But he is full red. He's, got, he's gonna get his health and he just runs yeah. away. Yeah. Uh, I, don't know. I think he made something out of that. He, but was, probably, I, he was full red and he, yeah. dead zone wasn't. I think that was actually a smart decision. True. He, he did start getting his health back. Maybe he could have made something out of it. I think that might have been his only chance. As he's just gonna get Lancer down right now. He's full red. He's able to get away and get his health back though. Um, getting stuck on walls, full red. I'm surprised he's not down. Yeah, Tuna's just gonna wait out another boom, I think. Oh, oh he wait gets a minute. Tuna down. He comes around towards nades, and Jesus now has down Tuna twice. If he but can, that, if he can that, cross that, him, it's down him one more time. Oh, but Tuna, no, not sure Jesus gets out. So one oh. situation right now. He's trying to push up, and he gets down again. Not wow. Dead zone literally with this pistol down him in half a second before he could even react. That was crazy. Well, that pistol is unrestricted now. Some people have just are nuts with that. Oh, you know, no, they have no fire rate uh, cap on it. It's just, it, it's weaker, but it, if you have a fast trigger finger, it doesn't matter. Mm, no, I agree with that. So now it's two one in favor of unknown, and you know I was I thought PBR was the uh, was the better team, but it looks like unknown is trying to prove me otherwise. As tuna fish is just he, well, he's already at digger. He, he's got a good spot. Eddie is about to be a one v one right here. Scissor taking out Simon. And, uh, oh, oh. Ooh, Scissor is getting two kills with nades in this round. As uh, Jesus tried to pick him up, but he was able to explode the nade. And Hax is actually also going to go down. Yep. So three versus one situation. It's looking really good for Unknown so far. Oh. And here's the thing. You know, uh, people wouldn't think that Unknown is a better team than BBR. If I still ask people, even if they win this match, people might not say that Unknown is a better team. But that's the thing about tournaments in Gears of War. If you are on fire in a tournament, you can do anything. Even if you're not the best team online, you go to a tournament on LAN or, you know, maybe start playing a tournament and you start off well and you play really good, you can really make things happen. You can see from match to match with that stride. But we can't stop us so, and I think that might be what no one's doing. They've just been on a roll right now. They haven't lost yet. They beat Malice even, so it's crazy. So let's hop on board Dead Zone. He's leading the charge. He's got three kills, five downs, and uh, unknown only one round away from taking the first map here in the PBR. <sighs> Stay awake, my friend. Yeah, I know. I'm getting tough now. <laughs> tough. As uh, Dead Zone and Tuna are both over here by uh, Bulldog. Laundry room as Tuna is able to secure the boom once again. That's three times in a row, and he picks off Simon. He's now a four. They give, they keep giving up boom, and that's the difference. PBR has got to stop that push for the boom, and uh, they just haven't done it yet. As Tuna picks up another kill, making great use of these booms. He's now a four v one situation. Jesus is the last man standing, and he is taken down by Dead Zone. And Unknown takes the first map over BBR. Four to one. Wow, so just like that then, pretty decisively too, you know, 4-1 to one isn't even a contest. No. And uh, BBR, my teams are letting me down, what is up with me? Maybe I'm just having bad picks? <laughs> I don't know, man, what is the, uh, what is the, ne what, oh, we'll check out, check out, actually I think they're going to skip to the king of the hill, aren't they?